Hi guys, and welcome to the Rainbow Six Replays YouTube channel. Today we want to present a video replay of the match highlights between Team Fnatic and Wolves Esports during the Europe League 2024 Stage 2. Don't forget to subscribe and put a like. Enjoy. As we can see Mowgli's health just chipping down somewhat. Deepak stunned out of position. Gonna be forced out there. Acer gonna pick up the first kill over onto Kanto. This responded to though. Mowgli through the breach. It's gonna take a beating as Deepak finds himself too. Right place, right time before he too will fall. Removing those keeper barriers from play, removing those pieces of utility. We've got Banshees, we've got Fnats, all sorts of things that you're going to have to try and contend with. Sarks takes one on to last mile as Leon joins in on the action as well. Deadshot from the breach. Defense to have a lot going for themselves. And obviously the, the guys in the desk talked about this. You know, Fnatic didn't look too bad in the defense. It was the attacks which were the issues for them. But they're still pushing here, Wolves, doubling up. Lasmu and Mowgli, another flashbang, just slowly but surely clearing their way down. Oh, what are you doing? A sprint across, but somehow Wolves come out on top as Lasmu. A great shot on the Jegs, that has to be said. It's now Fnatic. Be down a man. Leon's still upstairs trying to hold it down by himself, but no, he gets taken out as P4 swings. I mean, that Doka be Ollie putting a lot of work just to get Wolves into the position where they can just start taking these gunfights. Oh, a bullet hole, not bullet hole, punch hole, should I say, sorry. From Sarks eliminates people. So his location is known. The stuns, they're going to start to come in as well, but he tanks it. The FNAT is active, but pushes all the way through. Last mile has been downed in the fray. Now one versus one, and there's a bulletproof camera. Sarks. What a performance. I think were absolutely crucifying Fnatic as they went for those Rome games. You know, they, they were really clear and concise. And I think Fnatic probably, or sorry, Wolves probably thought, we can just do the same. We know they're going to Rome. We'll just go at them. We'll do, we'll do what ITB did. But then I, I think you're then underestimating that Fnatic could even... I mean, you need to try and get some form of breach going right now, but P4 is able to sneak in and Find a kill on to Leon, who was obviously patrolling. And look at this from Fnatic. They're now going to move away from the top floor. Straight in towards the mid floor site now. And Sony down the Jegs by himself. Another scrappy round from all accords. And Jegs gets eliminated. The Blitz all hard onto a Dokubi. That's the way they'll revolve around, you know, their gameplay. Towards top Mez. That wall reinforced and banded it. It just causes a lot of issues for them. Asa now rotating towards the main breach. Oh, Sarks misses the headshot. Wonder if that's going to cause costly for him. And two kills come out of nowhere for Wolves. P4 Mowgli on the each. P4, I mentioned before, was looking for that backstab. And Sarks is able to retake. He just sprints full in. A whole lot of trouble from Wolves. Jags now in the 1v4. Retake now in towards Master, seeing what he can do. Is it gonna be enough? I'm not entirely sure. And towards server he goes now, but this is what I mean. This is a room of a lot of angles you have to be worried about. Somehow creeps is all the way up, but no. The office, of course. He can maybe try and get that uh, boiler wall open. Just d denies that kind of retake in towards connector. I don't even know if they need it right now as they're picking up kills. Mowgli, again, in the mix. Picking up kills here, there, and everywhere. Flashbangs. Obviously causing a lot of issues right now as well for Fnatic and they're just slowly but surely dropping like flies. Inside a lab is where Sarks is going to be situated. Some a nice kill on the P4. 30 seconds left. Still no sign of the defuse being initiated here from Wolves, but they will take their time. Jegs is almost locked into this engagement with Mowgli. He knew he jumped in the window. There we had the boss G hit its mark. Sarks has been able to find a kill. Using the Goyo canister and now a 2v2 again for Wolves. It's just crumbling at the seams. Actually being locked off by the smoke. They're playing for kills perhaps. Jags takes a lot of damage, but no, Lasmu loses his engagement. Fnatic once again, hold on to the basement. See there, Sarks in the mix yet again and Jags. That boss G, man, it's so devastating. Yeah. Especially when you can hold an angle like that with an ACOG. And it's a body shot kill, essentially, at that sort of range. And, and even like 
couple of shots put back in return. Deadshot does need to be cautious on that breach. Could get swung at a moment's notice. Jegs, play prone, is going to take Mowgli down. Might even be able to revive at this point as well as Leon. He's got back onto his feet with 20 HP. Oh, he's starting to line him up and knock him down. So difficult to play against. The Azami barriers are putting in a lot of work. Deadshot, able to get the first kill for Wolves, but four more to find. A bit difficult ask. All of them very compact. Not a lot of movement, I would say, from Fnatic. They can't really do much. Very claustrophobic. All angles going to be covered off, but as long as that diffuser is not going down, then Fnatic will just win the round outright. And it's working for them right now. Deadshot and Lasmu. Only down to Lasmu now, but he goes down as well. To really get a hold of that. And it is an awkward shape of a site to try and take a lot of advantage of as well. See to have you're pushing into this little tiny kill box almost that c4 is going to be rattling through smokes are going to be there there's going to be a lot of issue it has been done and now it can move toward the next stage try and get that wall open and try and get a pick off the back of it bit of distraction tactic here as leon doesn't have an idea as to where the player's gone chooses the worst what? time to hit the reload Mowgli. he peeks him and takes his head clean off Fortunately for Leon, the rest of his team are firing and Starks is going to take Deadshot down. Last mile, Mowgli left in the clutches here. Deathmark, that's going to be out on last mile at the moment. So they're going to know exactly where he is. And Mowgli hasn't got a great deal of hit points to be working with either. Starks, three kills on the round, looking to make it a fourth as the plank goes down from Kanto. Starks with a... He don't have a Nomad here. Gonna maybe try and use that as a little bit of a buffer. Gonna take a good chunk of damage, but it's not gonna matter. Finds himself a brilliant kill. Chance of one through the window as well. If he's patient enough, it's a tough shot for the SMG, but he puts some damage down. Leon will be able to take down Mowgli, and eventually Deadshot will fall. Deepak. Not sure that he's down. Not sure if he's downed him or uh, if he's still up at the moment. He's going to get the confirmation now. Can see the blood trail on the floor. Happens and Amos ping Ten seconds on the P4. He can see Jags, of course. Who is trying to get the diffuser down? Five and C4 will miss though, and Jags will initiate the plan again. Leon gives the cover. Down goes Asen. Now P4 all by himself. Diffuser will go down into the 1v2. Look at the HP though from Sarks and Jags. This is perhaps winnable from P4. Gets tagged up though from behind. Red ping, yellow ping, and they know someone's lurking on him. There'll be demos tracked as well, but look at the floor in Ollie. It is ripped up fully. Attackers no safe position that P4 can really by. get to try and sneak in this defuse. Constantly being pinged. And there we are. It's a brilliant performance, isn't it? Now, we've seen one, we've seen two play days last week. So it's it's fair to say that Wolves were the number one team, but they'd only played two opponents. They played into the breach and they'd played VP. Both were the opponents. It's not like they're playing, you know, air quotes, bottom of the barrel teams. But Fnatic are really taking them to the cleaners right now. Someone could rotate onto, the, onto that bridge. And I mean, Jeg should know that it's, it's, it's pretty dangerous over there and he's going to be calling that out because that's where the rotation is going to come through from p4 leon he's going to find himself one before mowgli trades back onto Deepak. leon's still looking to try and charge up these rocket stairs but a goo mine will slow him down briefly the diffuser is in the hands of kanto he's going to try and look to push him but he hasn't got the fortune of the breach on his side instead mowgli's going to take him down but not before leon picks up his second still a chance here for Fnatic, but it's going to require a lot of fancy gunplay and well who better to do it than starks he's 13 and 3 right now and he could very well be the shining star that they need he's got a great bit of info on this jiggle peak oh, and leon's able to word. deal with it mowgli he's Five gonna fall seconds. leon gets downed in the midst three seconds left on the clock you've got a no sprint time. you've got to run but p4 he's gone Holy. But surely is how they want him to go around this, Sarks. Oh, barely misses out on that kill. Well, it's exchange, but I are doing a great deal to each other. Jegs looking to get active straight in through a window into the thick of things. This server room has got a lot of road a lot of holes. Will he pick up a kill from it? Yes, he will. Lazmu gets caught out. Wolves, just too much area that they needed to try and cover. There's not enough manpower to do so. It's a big map. 
for that reason. P4, though, able to trade Kanta with a pistol. Almost flies P4, but Sark springs into the 2v2, and Sark's a 2v1 now. We're trying to make something happen with that, but it doesn't look like they're acting off too much info. And P4 times this right, this could be devastating. No Especially if he waits for them to drop, the bees go out, but it isn't going to stop him from pushing on through. Can he find no the first? Yes. Five Easy pickings on the there. second. Surely he could have seen him there. Oh, Instead, there he's going to get the job done from the hatch. P4. A 6-4 margin. So Fnatic have to be increasingly careful here. Just a bombs like I mentioned before, Ollie. Like, no teams are allowed to win these on defense, but they've done extremely close to Leon. It's going to be really difficult for them. A smoke canister as well goes in. Delays a little bit of time. I mean, realistically for Lazmu, he just has to just sit and hold one angle. Everything else can be covered by his teammates. Just get the feeling that Lazmo is going to pick himself up too here, don't you? He's primed and ready, Maybe but not. as I say that, he's going to have to. He wants to try and keep Wolves in this. A flurry of kills from Fnatic. And they're firmly cemented an advantage here. Four versus two right now. Death mark oh out. Great shot there from last mile. We said he needed Away. kills and he's picking them up. Grabs himself a second, but Deepak. Go down, Leon. Gonna nail that diffuser to the floor. Is an angle able to be found? Yes, it is. Picks the down and dips himself away. 10 seconds. Time is of the essence. Deepak has to chase. He can't get caught trying to put this plan down. Misses his shots. Unforgivably, P4. He's had another 3K. Yeah, there's been a big moment on the side of Fnatic. We've had Sarks with his moment in the sun. Attack responded who had been dropped. It's just, boy, it's oh boy, what a round. It's, just, it's two heavyweights going up against each other. P4 is right outside of Ops, just in that 90. At some point, he's going to have to make that transition through, and it's going to be a tough gunfight to win. Just gets a glimpse there, but can't land the shot. On to P4. P4 with his Teflon jacket on right now. Nothing is shutting him down. Trade going one for one. Deepak starting to get this plant down under adequate cover this time as well. P4 is going to be approaching again. He's going to have a lot to do, but not this time. Jegs takes him out. He's left to try and hold on. Deadshot and last mile. Both up. Revive going to come through as well. Jegs, can he keep finding these kills? He's got two so far, but he needs a whole host more. Defender Gets downed, and there's plenty of time to disable that diffuser. Wolves, they're going to take round number 12. Fnatic, this has gone from 6-2. Well, maybe you get to see it this time. Ooh, Cancel gets lucky there and gets even luckier on the shots. Pre-fires out onto Mowgli. Sarks. Pinch him out, but I'll be honest, they're gonna have to waste a lot of time trying to go for dead shot here and they know exactly where he is. It's just can they nail him where he stands? But I mean look at this from dead shot. Wow! No way if he hit that last shot, that would have been incredible. Pistol comes out as well, but no. It's taken out, but it doesn't matter. He has done incredibly well. Give information away as well. Vulcan Canister is going to get popped and just slow down any approach through. And P4 is going to work off the back of that info and he's able to take Leon down. Jegs, 30 seconds, three kills to find. Got a bit of info with the bees and does have the diffuser, but realistically, they know which doorway he's pushing through. He might have info, but he's going to have to hit a couple of these nice one taps. He's going to try and pull this one off. Give him the 20 bomb. Give him the 20 bomb. He deserves it. Been located. Ten seconds you killed P4. There's one. Acer, he's gonna fall. P4, get your 20 bomb. Come on. Now's the time. Oh, you've got to let him have it now. Let P4 have it. No. 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 During overtime after one round. For me, it was all about dead shot here. Could have been four kills as well, very easily. But two was enough, at least in that push. Deadshot almost as a kind of lurk position to try and pick up the roamers as maybe they try and charge back in, but that's because they have the shield, but fishing this side of the map, Ollie, that's what I mean. There's so many different angles, so many crossfires that you will just get established from, but somehow it's working out for them. Just four kills right now. Throwing down to Kano, but he's going to get eliminated as well.